What is going on guys? Welcome back. In this video today, we're going to learn how to easily convert Word files or docx files to PDFs in Python. So let us get right into it. All right, so this is going to be quite a quick tutorial today. We're going to learn how to easily take docx files or Word files and convert them to PDFs in Python. And this can be useful for a number of different use cases. For example, you might want to automate some invoicing or some contracting where you have templates in docx, you want to fill them out and then you want to export them as PDF, or you just want to build an automation script that takes hundreds or thousands of Word files and converts them to PDF without you having to do it manually. Whatever it is, we're going to look at two ways to do that. One is going to be a very easy way that only works on Windows with Word installed. And the other one is going to be one that is platform independent. And since I'm on Linux, I'm going to uh, actually only get the second one to work, but I'm going to show you the first one because it's quite simple. And if you're on Windows with Word installed, you can just use it. So first of all, I have this file dot, uh, docx here. I can open it and show it to you. It's basically just a simple... A file with hell world. This is a word file, we have some different formatting in here, and then some table data just so we have something to actually convert to PDF. Don't be irritated by the dark mode here. This is still a, uh, a white background when it's uh, when it's done. Or if uh, dark mode was not enabled. But this is the file that we're going to convert. Now the Windows way to do that is actually quite simple, you open up your command line and you type pip or pip three install on Windows usually pip install and then you install docx to PDF. This is an external Python package and all you have to do now to actually do the conversion is you have to say from docx to PDF import convert and then you literally just have to say convert and then file docx and then uh, whatever the output file is. So output dot PDF, for example. Now, if I run this here on Linux, you're going to see the problem not implemented error docx to PDF is not implemented for Linux as it requires Microsoft Word to be installed. So you can see I cannot do this on Linux. If you're running this on Windows with Microsoft Word installed, you should just get a conversion and it's fine. And this is the simple way to do it on Windows. Now on Linux, we can do it with core Python, but we need to install a package on our system, it comes oftentimes pre installed already, but you need to have LibreOffice installed. So on Debian based distributions, you just use apt, so sudo apt install and then LibreOffice. And of course, on the different Linux distributions, you just use whatever package manager you're using. So you install LibreOffice. In my case, I already have it installed. Uh, actually, I think this is some some upgrade or something, some something additional here. In my case, I have LibreOffice installed. So just make sure you have the command available so that when you open up your command line, you can just go LibreOffice and you can see that it actually opens up. Uh, it actually opens up the LibreOffice application. And we're going to use it headless in the command line. So we're going to just say import OS, we're going to say import sub process. And then all we have to do is we have to run a command using Python. So sub process run, and we pass a list of arguments or a list of keywords here. The first one being the tool that we actually use LibreOffice. The second one is the flag that we want to use it headless. So we don't want to use actually any graphical user interface. So just run it in headless mode. Then we want to provide the convert to tag. So dash dash headless dash dash convert to then we specify that we want to convert to PDF. Then we specify that our input file is going to be our file doc x. And then our output directory output, or actually out dear is the keyword here is going to be some directory. In my case here, I'm going to go with temp TMP. I'm going to set check equal to true. And the reason I want to save this in TMP is because this command will always produce a file.pdf, but maybe I want to call this output.pdf. So what we're going to do is we're going to save it in the temp directory, and then we're going to move it and rename it uh, to output PDF. So this is going to produce a directory temp, which is going to contain a uh, contain a file.pdf. And what I want to do then is I want to say os.rename. And then I'm going to go with tmp slash file.pdf. And I want to move this to output PDF. And when I run this, you're going to see that I get the temp folder, which is empty. And then you can see I get the output PDF here, I can open it. And you will see that I get my word file converted as PDF or to PDF. 
Uh, and of course, the file is no longer here in temp because I moved it. Renaming means moving. This is how it works with the OS module. If you do rename, you just move the file. Now, of course, you can also delete the directory, but you can also just keep it there for further conversions. This is how you can do that in an extremely simple way on Windows with a docx to PDF convert function. And on Linux, you just use the command line tool of LibreOffice um, with the headless um, headless flag, and then you convert to PDF, choose the file and specify an output directory from which you can then rename or move the file. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and hope you learned something. If so, let me know by hitting the like button and leaving a comment in the comment section down below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to not miss a single future video for free. Other than that, thank you much for watching. See you in the next video and bye.